Tonight, Primetime investigates Ireland's resurgent property market and asks, are we witnessing another housing bubble? Houses are expensive. And if we are, where does that leave ordinary people? This is Una Lampson. We asked her to play with her kids until we were ready for her. First, let's talk to the experts. If people don't get on the property ladder soon, it's Hasta La Vista, baby. How soon is soon? Tuesday. While the politicians who are in government say that enough is being done, the politicians who aren't in government say not enough is being done. The smaller houses never caused a boom. And it's stopping a boom and preventing that credit chasing prices, chasing credit kind of bubble. JFK once said that a rising tide lifts all boats. So let's have a look at a rising tide. Here's what happened to house prices over the last two years. And as you can see, the tide is rising. Now that's good if you own a house. On the other hand, if you're behind on your mortgage, it's now actually worth the bank's while to repossess your house. So when house prices go like this, repossessions go like this. Meanwhile, the tide is rising. You aren't in a boat. And you can't swim. Credit chasing prices, chasing credit kind of bubble. I love. If you are looking for someone to blame, blame the real estate agents. Well, I didn't do it. Like it or not, it looks like, once again, the property market is struggling to get its house in order.